the world that he gave his only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. 2,000 years ago there was a man called Jesus the Christ. He was sent from God the Father for you and for me to give up his life, to be crucified, to be beaten, to be crucified on a cross, to die the death that you and I deserve for our sin. What is sin, you may ask? Sin is an action or thought or word or deed in which you hurt God, yourself and other people. Jesus Christ came that, you, that He may suffer the penalty that you and I deserve because of our sin. And Jesus Christ is coming, He's asking you today to come to Him. He's asking you today to stop blocking your ears, stop turning off your heart to Him. Open your ears and hear the word of the Lord. He's calling you today. He said, come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me. For I am gentle and humble of heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. In this hope we were saved, but hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what he already has? But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. Without Jesus Christ, there is no hope. Without Jesus Christ, there is no future except an eternity separated from Him, an eternity in hell of eternal punishment because of your continual rejection of Him. He doesn't want you to go to hell, therefore He's calling you today. He's calling you to open up your ears and heart, to receive His Word, to listen to His promises and to stop rejecting Him. He came to earth that you may be His friend. He wants to be your friend and He wants you to be His. For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. And for that reason, Jesus Christ paid the penalty. Now He's asking you, He's asking you to open up your ears and receive His truth. Receive His promises that He promises in the Word of God, that is the Bible. He's saying, open up your ears. The thief comes on to steal kill and destroy. Jesus Christ came that we may have life and an abundant life. Any hope you have in this life apart from Christ is futile. It comes and it goes the same as the rain and the wind come and they go. But if you have hope in Jesus Christ, that hope can never be taken away. No matter what happens to you, Jesus Christ is there. No matter how lonely you get, no matter how much suffering you go through, Jesus Christ is there and He's calling you today to come to Him. Come, come to Jesus Christ. Now come.